Hello everyone! Today I want to share with you another tech video. I was tagged by Maggie. Her channel is My Favorite with Maggie. Maggie is really really one of the YouTuber I enjoy watching. She is very very real. Like her, her opinion, her funny story is so 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 good. Like you don't get bored when you watch her videos. So I will link her channel down below and please support her as well. So I am going to share with you 10 things that make me happy right now. Especially this year we really need it. I think this year just so many uncertainty and now the election is coming, just more chaos. And I think it's a good thing for us to think back what makes us happy and I like we can share this with each other to make everyone happier. So as you can see, I'm in a different room today. I currently in my son's playroom because when I think of happiness, the first thing of course is him. Before this COVID-19, I usually go to the office maybe like by 7.30 a.m. So I don't really get to see him in the morning. But now since I work from home, so in the morning he usually come to my room to wake me up. And he went me out in the cutest way. He'll tell me, Mommy, Mommy, time to wake up. Mr. Sun is up. And sometimes I will say, But I'm still so tired. I want to sleep. And he'll touch my face and say, It's okay, Mommy. And he'll climb to my bed and just give me so many kisses. And then he'll keep saying, Mommy, I love you so much. And I know he's just three. So uh, this cute face is going to go away sooner than I want. I really cherish those moments and it's really like the best way to start my day and it really made me happy. So that's the first thing made me happy. And the second thing made me happy definitely is my job. So I'm really happy and really fortunate that I still have my job during this year and not just because my job pay me it's um it's the work i do i really enjoy of course i'm not going to say oh i love my job every day no i don't there's up and down the part made me happy is the thing i do uh, i'm in corporate finance so the the analysis i do i provide can really make my boss my boss is cfo so the work i do can really help the executive team to make decision of like are we going to let people go or are we going to purchase another company of course they don't really just make decision as the way i want but the work i do is the tool they use and they rely on so that made me happy because i know i bring the value to the company i bring the value to the team so i i'm not really afraid of losing job during this year at all because i know they follow my work and that made me happy and i know my work matters for them so that made me happy and the third thing made me happy is is after my job that's my luxury handbags and my jewelry because if i don't have my job i don't think i can get to enjoy those stuff and the handbags, the jewelry, I know it's just material stuff but that made me happy is because I know that's something I can afford by myself I don't need to ask anyone's permission of buying anything I really just buy something from me and to me so that made me happy is I I'm, and in this category I am independent to be able to afford the thing I like and of course, there's some other things that I love I can't afford, but that's okay because it just I'm not there yet. But right now, the thing I can afford, the thing I can enjoy, it made me really, really happy. And the fourth thing made me happy is when me and my husband and my son we can have dinner together. Because my husband's job is not good. it's not regular it's not regular hours every day. Sometimes he need to work night shifts and sometimes he need to work during the weekend. So we don't really have dinner together every single day. So the days we can have dinner together, it's always made me very happy. 
like when I come home, I can cook dinner and everyone can enjoy together. That made me very, very happy. And the next thing would be after my kids go sleep and me and my husband still not too tired, still have energy to watch a TV show together or watch a movie together, just cuddle and talk to talk to each other. That made me happy and we are in the 10 years of our relationship so I really try to be very mindful. I don't want like the life, the kids drove our marriage apart. Like I don't want to become like a roommate, you know, like some old couple they just don't get to spend time with each other often so they end up become like a roommate and I don't want that so whenever we can spend time together after our kid goes sleep we can just watch a TV or watch some YouTube video to laugh together that always made me very happy and the sixth things made me happy is when I can FaceTime with my parents because this year due to the COVID-19 I couldn't go back home to see them. Since I was here, I always go to back home once a, at least once a year, but this is the first time I couldn't go back yet. So when I can FaceTime with them and I know they are doing well, they are happy, they are healthy, and that made me happy. And the next thing is coffee. I am the coffee addict. I needed my coffee in the morning when I start working before I start working. And after lunch, I need my afternoon pick up coffee before I start working. And sometimes if I have a really busy and tiring day, I need another coffee before I pick up my kids from daycare because I, I, I need another energy shot before I can fully engage with him. So I enjoy good coffee. I I like espresso, I like the coffee can make me excited. I know that doesn't sound good for my health, or, but I love coffee. And the next thing made me happy is YouTube. Not just I upload video on YouTube, it's when people actually watch my video and like my video, or my video really helps some people, and that made me happy. And of course, sometimes, it also made me sad when I know the content doesn't really get to get feel or get liked. And I, I like like when I have new subscribers, they are not from YouTube channel, like the generally enjoy my content. That made me really happy. And I know I the 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 way I grow my channel is very very slow, I know, and maybe because I don't put enough content regularly, so I'm still working on that and I know my English sometimes bothering people, like my pronunciation, my vocabulary just not that good, and trust me, I'm aware of it and I'm still working on that, I'm consistently trying to improve myself. So please, if you are watching this video, if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. And if you have any suggestion, please comment down below. That really, really make my day. And the next thing is we can get away. So now we can really travel. We, we haven't really go anywhere besides just like drive to some local place and stay a night for, in the hotel, enjoy the pool. And that made me happy. Like, it's, it's something like we can relax and just three of us spend time together and it really doesn't matter what we do, it's just when we are together and we all focus on each other, like not just playing phone or watch TV, it's really just spend time together, play in a pool together, that made me very very happy. And the last thing made me happy is our house. Uh, we moved to move, we move into this house last year, and it's not like something a fancy house. It just um, we pick many stuff for this house together. We pick the tile, we pick the color for our kitchen cabinet, just something like that. And every day when I come home, I'm happy we are here. Three of us are here, and my son is going to growing up here. 
I'm happy we have a place, our home, and it just made me happy, like walking happily. So these are the 10 things made me happy right now. And it just, it's interesting to when you film this video because you really have to list down the thing that make me happy. I really make a list on my phone. And when I make a list to think about what things made me happy, and that made me feel like I'm so blessed. I I'm really feel I can't thank God enough. Especially during, the, during this year, it's just so many uncertainty, so many bad news we hear every day on the news. And I'm just glad we are here, like a present right now, at this moment. I can be here and to talk to you about what made me happy. So if you enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up and I will take some of you and please let me know what make you happy. And we are almost done with 2020. I'm just hoping everyone be safe and be healthy, be happy. See you next time.